The Navy spent time with the local swim team. I noticed they had a strong season. This is a report on how our lady, lady Lobos, improved. Now here's the interview with Ms. Crichton. Um, how did you like this season? Um, I really like this season. Um, I got to see a lot of girls swim and improve and get better, and I was pretty excited this season. This is the first time ever we had 18 girls swim this year. Coach Kreitzer made her point when during the recent practice, the cameras picked up the togetherness of the Purple Cats. Um, because it takes a lot of guts to come out there, and if you don't know how to freestyle, to do the to learn the freestyle and understand how to do the freestyle and not be afraid of the water. And then on the flip side, the most dedicated girls there is if they already know the freestyle, they had to learn the butterfly. And the butterfly is kind of hard, and it takes a lot of dedication to be like, all right, I'm gonna go and learn this one. Why were the Lady Lobos so hard to beat this season? Well, we asked Coach Chrysler, and this is what she said. There are some girls, when I look at my list and I look at it and I think about, I think about Emery and I think about Euridia and Jessica and Zitlali and Angelica and Maggie, you know, um, these kids started in my lane, they didn't even know how to swim and by the end of the season, these girls were swimming in full entire length, which is pretty amazing. Then I also think about my high kids, I think about Skye, who didn't know how to do diving and now she's diving and she made it to championships. I think about Bailey and Selena and Samira and Veronica and Lexia and Lenore and Nixa and Ajene. Um, I think about Emanuela. These girls started off just knowing how to do the freestyle, not very good, and now by the end of the season they're doing really more difficult strokes like the butterfly, like the brush stroke. After Coach Kreitzer's directions, we caught up with a few of our fellow Lobos to get their opinion on the season. Like when you, first of all, you have to flip underwater, and if you don't do like the breathing right, you start choking on all the water. So it's kind of hard. <laughs> Sounds cool. Did, did you have fun during the season? Yes, I did. What was your favorite event? My favorite event was freestyle. Um, diving, like it was hard at first, but now it's like awesome. Did you have fun during the season? Yes. What was your favorite event? The 200 freestyle that I had was when I had to swim re relays, I had to um, swim as fast as I could because my other teammates wouldn't swim as fast as they wanted. How could the purple caps improve? So there are some things that the purple caps can do. Um, the first thing that they can do is that they can um, make sure that they get their physical over the summer and they start the first day of practice. The more they're in the water, the better they can be. It's the same thing with any of the sports. As soon as you can start practice, it's really important. That's the most number one thing that they could do. My other suggestion is, if you would like to be on the swim team, is to take swim classes in the summer, take swim lessons over the summer. Next 
time on another episode of Love Out TV. Uh, Deuces, uh, uh, as uh, the uh, young people say. Uh, 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 Deuces. Uh, 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 Stop the camera, what you doing?